guys so happy 2023 yes we made it to another year and this morning we wake up and we decide to make some porridge we're going to make some caramel porridge so felix decide he want to help so let's go are you ready to make some porridge yeah okay so what are you going to do pour a little bit in the water of vanilla yeah in the water put it up my hand is getting burned like that pour a little bit more okay Ooh, good it burned my hand that burned felix yes oh please take this mm. put some cinnamon in yes a lot put put some more <laughs> And we're going to leave that the water don't even act yet it's some of this that ketchup and some of the vanilla so put a little bit more cinnamon inside it you want your porridge to be nice right mm -hmm. all right okay that's good and we're going to leave it boil we're going to pinch a little bit of salt and put inside the water and then we're going to leave it boil and then we're going to whisk the caramel and we're going to add the caramel to it right and eat it all right give me your hand so inside your hand i'm just going to tip like that amount of salt <laughs> here and put it in the pot now good job brush it off like so inside the pot yes and then we're going to leave that boiled up and get some flavors and smell some good and we're going to start Mama, with the porridge yes Mama, what about the thing the wish thing the thing what you had on the table there the nutmeg the nutmeg go after oh. okay so after the porridge finished to cook we're going to add oh, the nutmeg inside it let's, let's. okay so let's go over this side to waste some coconut milk to put inside the porridge okay yes, I'm gonna... so we're using some coconut milk inside of the porridge so we don't have the fresh coconut so we're using this one this morning in the package <laughs> let me throw it for you guys mama let me shake it shake it shake it and because we're not cooking a big pot of porridge we're just going to use half of the package like so a lot that's a lot baby yeah all right so i'm going to add some water inside it and you're going to whisk it okay okay whisk it up now yes baby hold it yeah and whisk it and yeah. you see everything inside it dissolving right yeah and what you're going to do next after yeah. you finish to whisk it then we're going to put this in there. No, we're going to put that, this, the coconut milk in the pot so it can boil. And then after, we're going to add the caramel to it. Right? Yeah. Very good, Felix. Very good. Okay, let's go over to the stove now to pour it. Pour it. it. Pour it. All right, pour it. Good oh. job. Yeah, pour that coconut milk. Yeah. It almost touched my hair. <laughs> As usual. Then what I'm gonna do? I'm oh! going to pour some caramel like so. Like that inside that bowl. The caramel looks so glittery. Yeah. And then we're going to add some water inside it. And then we're gonna whisk it. Yeah. Whisk till till it dissolves. Till dissolve? Yeah. <laughs> Like I'm doing something. A head right, spin. Let's go, Felix. I'm doing a head spin. <laughs> Alright, whisk it, baby. <laughs> You're going to get hard first, so you have to whisk it. You hold it, hold it properly. Hold it still. Okay? Okay. Will you see that? Ooh, it's okay. Yeah. When you finish, you clean, okay? Okay. Look at it, guys. 
and then we are going to add it to the pot okay take your time and pour oh oh look it catch me okay and just whisk it in to incorporate everything together okay guys look at that look how beautiful that is look at my caramel porridge yes so it's already 15 minutes since it have been boiling. So I'm going to leave it for another 10 minutes or another 15 minutes. And then we're going to add the milk to it. I don't have no tin milk this morning. I have almond milk. I have box milk, jug milk, powdered milk. But because I'm making it like a Jamaican and in a Mickey, and then using Lasco milk and mix it. This morning, we are going to use Fisher Flan milk and mix it. So look at that. It's beautiful. Caramel porridge, take me back to Jamaica. Okay, guys, this is the Fisher Flan milk that we're using this morning. So I just pour some inside this container. And then I'm just going to pour some water inside it, mix it out like so like that look at that guys i remember me telling you say normally in jamaica we know use some lasco some white lasco to make it or some condensed milk to make it or just the coconut milk itself but this morning we are using some powdered milk look how that is and we are going to bring it over there and add it to the we're just going to pour it like so inside the pot and whisk it in and look how the color start to change immediately okay guys so we're grating some nutmeg inside of the porridge it's a must we're going to give it some good 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 flavor so i'm using half of this nutmeg if you cannot get the fresh one you can buy the one in the bottle or the powder one but inside your caramel porridge nutmeg is a must look at that guys beautiful and as i say in every video i make i don't add sugar inside my porridge for nobody anybody want sugar have to add it there self so i'm finished to make it so this is a time when you could go ahead and add your sugar but because i'm not adding it to the porridge whenever i pour it out if they need sugar they would add their own sugar and i'm just going to pour it inside the bowl now turn off my stove and the caramel porridge is finished okay guys so i'm just pouring it inside of my bowl So this for Sean, this for Kissy, this for Felix, this for me. And we're finished. So let's go and eat some caramel porridge. Listen, guys, listen. <laughs> I made my porridge and I put it down to get cool because I cannot drink hot porridge. I cannot. I just cannot stand on hot porridge. My porridge have to be cold. Then I make the the porridge with my mommy okay so i have to drink my porridge when it's cold 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 because to i want to enjoy my porridge if it is hot i cannot drink it listen me got my bed last night around 11 o'clock you know because me did tired so me got my bed to sleep so me never seen nothing about new year nor happy new year nor nothing the kids was up so they see it I made the porridge and I put the porridge down to cool and I say, you know what? Let me go take a nap. <laughs> Let me just go lay down until the porridge cool. So when I wake up, you know, not to just sleep, but just to take a little nap because I'm tired. So I lay down and I fall asleep. Felix, I'm on the phone. I lay down and I fall asleep. 
I fall asleep, I just see my daughter come and wake me up and tell me, Mommy, <laughs> come and drink your porridge. Mama. So I jump up to come and drink my porridge right here. So. Mama, when you was sleeping, I, I, was, I was in your room, then I call him porridge. Okay, it's so good, guys. When I tell it, it's good. It's so good. You can taste the coconut milk. You can tell it's a powdered milk mix it because the creaminess of the porridge. You can taste the vanilla. You can taste the cinnamon. You can taste the nutmeg. You can taste everything inside this porridge right here, this caramel porridge. Anyway, guys, happy 2023. Today is the 1st of January. I hope all your wishes come true. I hope what you did not achieve in 2022, you will achieve it in 2023 here as we start. I hope you don't make a new year res resolution, a same name, and then you don't complete it. You don't go through with it. You're reaching the halfway of it and you stop. I hope you get to save this year because a lot of people did not get to save. Felix? Okay, that's it. Because a lot of people didn't get to save last year because of the pandemic. Maybe some people lose their job. Maybe some people try to hustle for themselves, but they didn't get everything that they wanted to be done, done in time before 2022. Finish. But listen, don't lose hope. Don't lose faith. You understand? You, you on the other year, you get an opportunity. You get a chance to meet the other year. That is today. And that is a, a blessing. When I tell you that is a blessing to just wake up this morning. You don't get no formal news that your family is sick, no death, nothing. It's just a blessing to just get up and smell the fresh air. And knowing that you're in the land of the living this morning, that is a lot to give God thanks for. Because many people this morning didn't wake up. Many people yesterday did not live out the day the 31st many people did not do it yesterday and many people as i say did not wake up the eyes didn't wake up this morning to see 2023 the first of january many people fall sick last night and have to go by the hospital and wake up in the hospital this morning many people yesterday get a news that okay they have this sickness or this happen or some people don't even have the money to pay their rent put it like that this morning some people didn't have some people does not have the money to buy food for their family today the first of january and i get up and i can make myself some caramel porridge my kids are okay my family is good that's a lot to give god thanks for thanks to all 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 the people that support me throughout 2022 in my ups and my down i just want to say thank you i appreciate each and every one thank you to all my family members who call me or send me a message throughout 2022 just to check up on me just to see if i'm okay just to just to hear my voice and knowing i'm still in the land of the living this morning i just want to tell you all tell you all thank you and how much i appreciate you big up to all of my banana bread customer last year was lit with banana bread oh. and i hope to go through 2023 this year the same way with my banana bread my banana bread was a blessing mm -hmm. and i have to big up all my customer big up all my customer from ace from kui man from airport from levi's mm -hmm. from island water world 
from PDG, big up on yourself. Enough love, enough respect. I really appreciate you guys. May your basket never run dry for 2023. May your basket be filled. May every time you see, like, one minute, Felix, I come in. May every time you see, like, your basket going down, it just, you go to your bed and you wake up and your basket became full, become full again because of, of, of the blessing that God is going to place on your life. Let's go through 2023 20, with our mindset, with faith, with love, with joy, with peace with forgiveness forgiveness is a big word in everything so let's just go to go through 2023 with our mindset on what we want to achieve and don't just set your mind try to achieve everything you want to achieve yes felix um today's my okay so anyway guys bless up on yourself big up on yourself enough respect see you guys for the rest of the year we love you over here at shakima at home bye guys